Stephen Hawking first laid out his gravitational wave theorem back in 1971, which surmised that the surface area of a black hole's event horizon could only get larger, never smaller. The event horizon being the radius around the black hole where nothing can escape, not even at the speed of light. And it should grow proportionally to its black hole, which can only gain mass under laws of general relativity. And back in 2015, astronomers detected a gravitational wave for the first time, called GW150914. And now, nearly six years later, Hawking's theorem has finally been observationally confirmed. Black holes are extremely difficult to observe, mostly because they don't emit any radiation, so we must rely on observing the gravitational effects they have on space-time. GW150914 was one of these detectable events, a gravitational ripple colliding between two black holes, eventually joining the two and creating one larger black hole. The observation allowed researchers to calculate not only the mass and spin of the new black hole, but also the original two as well, revealing that the event horizon got bigger when the two joined, rather than smaller as it likely would have if that was possible, confirming Hawking's gravitational wave theorem once and for all.